The wait is over. This one's for all the marbles, and it's coming up next. It's the NWO against Team Diamond Dallas Page. mentioning, Corey, that he comes in tonight ranked number nine, which is a pretty accurate ranking, I would say, considering his performances of late. Though, I doubt he's satisfied with it. And we're ready to go, folks. And I wouldn't at all be surprised if this match stole the show here tonight. Music City is geared up and ready to go for this one. This match should be great. Into the collar and elbow tie-up. Only one competitor comes out ahead here. Talk a little about Scott Hall. What, in your opinion, can we all expect from him tonight? Controversy seemingly follows Scott Hall wherever he goes, guys, which likely means the referee's going to have his hands full in this one. Well, the time for talk is over now, and he knows it. Diamond Dallas Page is one of the most intense competitors a superstar can lock up with. DDP is never hesitant about going at an opponent. Page is WCW's People's Champion, and he'll do whatever it takes to make you feel the bang. Lex Luger is a force within the ring. 
Needs to make it to the corner. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. <sighs> now we have Randy Savage on the attack. That move at this juncture of the match makes the intention unmistakable to be little. Diamond Dallas Page is one of the most beloved superstars in WCW. DDP was known as the People's Champion. WWE had its own People's Champion in The Rock. To this day, fans wonder if that's a matchup we will get to see. You don't have to be a genius to see that Diamond Dallas Page was the heart of WCW during the Monday Night War. Page's intensity and love of throwing down put him nose to nose with the best WCW had to offer. Quick pin attempt here. Did you see that? That was almost too easy for the Macho Man to kick out of. Nice kick out there. Right in the midsection. Here. I expected nothing less, Cole. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Look at Diamond Dallas Page here. DDP, Diamond Cutter from Diamond Dallas Page. Perfectly executed, guys. Looking for the quick pin. One, two, and a two count only. Takes a lot more than that to tame the Savage. He's simply reminding him that he's here. There's the suplex. Looking to make a much needed. There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Showing off his vertical with that drop kick. Check out Scott Hall's offense. Check out Scott Hall's offense. Pinpoint precision on that elbow drop. Right into the center of the chest. Reversal by Lex Luger. He lands the overhand. He's able to summon that energy whenever he wants it. Check out Scott Hall's offense. Man, what a move. Unbelievable power. Quick thinking to avoid that one. Ill-advised move. Doesn't show any signs of getting up here, guys. No, he's taking one heck of a beating, Michael. 
He's really taking over this match now. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. We're seeing another reason why Hall's had such a great career. Look at him measuring. A mammoth slam right there, guys. This might be the opportunity he needs. He goes for the quick pin attempt. Well, I thought he had to pin for sure. Hey, I guess you never know. Not today. And he hits the belly to belly. Look at him catch him off guard. Oh, look at that. Scott Hall powering out. Just needs to do more damage. And there's the Russian leg sweep. No chance of staying upright after that one. Scott Hall is a force within the ring. Desperately needs to make a tag here. I don't know. It's going to be tough to make it to the corner. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. And there's the counter. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Still trying to get back to his feet here. He's clearly in a bad way right now. The challenger not in a great place. If they want to win this match, he really needs to make a tag soon. He needs a breather in a bad way right now. If he could just make it to his corner and make the tag. Guys, I wasn't anticipating great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Oh boy, he is rolling. He knows he's in trouble. See if he takes the bait. Torture act! He's looking good now, guys. You feel a stretch like that even after you escape. Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. Put it on a show now. In comes Randy Savage. And Byron, he's still down after that one. Yeah, that did some big time damage, Michael. He's going for it all. He's not getting up. You can't like his chances right now. Randy Savage. And he gets out of there in a hurry. Looks like he needs to regroup, get his thoughts together. Lex Luger's on the attack now. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. There's the switch. Diamond Dallas Page is in. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. Well, moves like that at this stage are not to win any match. It's, they're just used to send a message. And what a reversal from Diamond Dallas Page. Not so fast. Just making his presence felt there. For some competitors, part of their strategy is to demean their opponent. A move like that says it all. Could be getting ready for a trip to the diamond mine. Two. Scott Hall isn't being shy, but he better stay focused right now. He wants no part of the outside. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. Dallas Page gathering attention in a hurry. He's not looking good here, Byron. No, he's got to get up, and he's got to get up now. DDP. 
Picks him up. Face plant. What's he going to do now? He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. DDP. Diamond Cutter from Diamond Dallas Page. Can he make the tag, Tony? That's what needs to be done. Just crawl over. Crawl over Hall and make that tag. Get that fresh guy in there. Well, Dusty, I'm not sure he knows where he's at right now. Which corner? Which corner Luger's in? The man he has to tag. Both men, as you can see, dazed, hurt, and winded. But these are the top athletes in the world. He's got his bearings now. He knows which direction to go. He's Both men there. getting up. Who's the first man to make a tag? It's Page. And here comes the total package. But he goes right back at him again. Both men thrown together. Luger! Wreck oh, time! Go ahead! Stop this party before it starts, baby! I wouldn't doubt it if he could wreck them both right now. Referee did not see the over the top rope that time. And he's gonna wreck Scott Hall. Oh, yeah! Luger, yeah. he's gonna wreck he's Scott gonna... Hall! This could be it! This time! Bobby's oh. made a save! And that oh, was the only look at thing that, that Tony, prevented. Them oh. right in the eyes. Well, I'll tell you, if Savage had been five oh. seconds late, man. Oh, no. Tracked him, too. Right into DDP. No. He, he don't know who he got. He don't know what happened there. He backed into Luger, Tony. Wow. Luger has been the recipient of a diamond cutter inadvertently, and I don't think he's going to get up. Oh, no. He's not moving. Nobody gets up from the diamond cutter. Backed right into it, Tony. But four men are down here. They're all sprawled out. Scott Hall trying to make a tag here. Trying to crawl over. If he can make a cover, they're going to win it. Just put a hand on him. All he's got to do is put a hand on him. Oh, no. One, two, three. That's it. Thrown into DDP. And as he staggered back, he grabbed Luger for the diamond cutter, not realizing who he had a hold of. So the NWO but holds on to the belt. Here on the Clash of the Champions. And as you see from the top of the Minnesota Auditorium, something is falling. It looks like pamphlets. Propaganda. Flyers, leaflets, something. But I'll tell you, he had Hall up in the rack. He had him. He had him, he had him. Ray, he backed right into him after yeah. getting the thumb in the eye and just eased into him and, and diamond cut him right there. You see the propaganda. Their birthday party, as far as they are concerned, yeah. are successful. Fans, we are past the 10 o'clock hour, but we There's still no have more to come. Hopefully, we're going to hear from James J. Dillon. I don't know, but come on back with us. A lot more remaining live on the Clash of the Champions. Don't go away. The NWO continues its celebration. As a matter of fact, even though the members have left the ring, they apparently are on their way back here, and they are now being led by Eric Bischoff. So the celebration, the birthday they talked about, even though it looked as if WCW was getting the upper hand earlier in this telecast, they have a lot to be happy about right now. This party's not over. Everybody's on their feet too, guys. Watch this thing. At a birthday party, don't someone usually get spanked? Well, I think someone did. But it's not over yet. No, it's not. You know, as the members of the NWO were but walking night. out of the arena after they won, and we were in a commercial break, you could hear the chant began here at the Minnesota Auditorium in Nashville of We Want Sting. We Want Sting. And I think that sentiment of advance here in attendance in this capacity crowd echo our sentiments as WCW broadcaster, World Championship Wrestling employees, and certainly you fans who've been following us for many, many, many years. The first class was 1988, and Sting was a big part of that. But we have not seen him here tonight. 
as the NWR continues their big celebration. More pamphlets. More propaganda. Every member of the NWO is out there except one. And he's off doing a movie. But you know what? When it rains, it pours. the NWO. Happy birthday. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, we love you. Greatest night of my life. Mr. Hall, you are without a doubt one of the greatest athletes ever to step in to this sport, and I do want to say in our birthday, our anniversary, it is an honor just to know you. Oh, shucks, I think you're great too. Mr. Nash, what I've learned from you, you couldn't put in a volume of encyclopedias. I want to thank you on our anniversary. I just want to say it's been sweet for the last year to be shagging in the WCW, rotten, baby! But now we've got a little business we have to take care of. Because in our one year anniversary, our birthday party, we didn't get the surprise we wanted. We didn't get what we deserve, which is A, our own show. Because if it wasn't for the NWO and moi, none of you people would be here tonight. What be? Hollywood Hogan sends his love, but he also sends a message. He needs bigger limos and newer Learjets. Do you hear me, Mr. Ted Turner? It is time for you to pay up. of a once great man has risen a curse, a wrong that must be righted. We look to the skies for a vindicator, someone to strike fear into the black hearts of the same man who created him. The battle between good and evil has begun. Against an army of shadows comes a dark warrior, the prevailer of good, with a voice of silence and a mission of justice. This is 